Sort of feels like this weekend in particular, pollen really started to build up. Good news, of course, for the car washes. Not great news for those of us with allergies. Dave Peck gives us the latest on the season. How's your car? Looks horrible. Maybe you washed it this weekend. But with tree pollen levels high and a dry stretch of weather, chances are you'll be back again soon. I feel like I go through and then it's covered in pollen a second later. That's great news for the guys over at Espinosa Car Wash. The whole year is good, but this this time and a winter time, this is the best. Not the best for your runny nose, sore throat, or itchy eyes this spring. This year in particular, it seems like more folks are coming in for allergies and they seem more severe and they have been coming in earlier in the season. No matter how bad it's been, allergy season wasn't going to sneak up on Anna Maria Santos. I think I got ahead of the game and I started taking Allegra uh, right in the beginning, so I've been pretty good about it. Allie Ramos, though, she said it's been difficult determining whether her kids are dealing with allergies or maybe something else. Other viruses cause a lot of the same symptoms as environmental allergies, um, which is sore throat, runny nose. The itchy eyes is generally pretty much only caused by these environmental allergies. Depending on the symptoms, Dr. Wood said there are several over-the-counter drugs that can provide relief. For anyone who's not sure what they're experiencing or if they're having more severe symptoms like those fevers and chills, or if their symptoms are not controlled with over-the-counter medications, I really do recommend going to the doctor. That was Dave Peck reporting. According to AccuWeather, tree pollen is the primary aggravator right now in Maine. It will likely get worse throughout the week. Ragweed, mold, and grass are low.